Exactly two years ago, many Nigerians came out to vote out the previous administration and they all shared in change. They all said they wanted change. So they voted our president, ex-president Goodluck Jonathan, and brought in President Muhammad Buhari. Two years afterwards, we decided to come here to ask Nigerians, are you happy with the change you voted for? Or if they regret voting for the same change they clamored for about two years ago. My name is Damilari Okola. Welcome to Street Gist on Night.com TV. We want to ask Nigerians out there what they think about President Muhammad Buhari's administration two years after bringing him to power. Would they still vote for him in 2019 or the kinds they just wait to have him live there? Find out what Nigerians are saying. Let's go. Why do you want to know that? I want to know because it's already two years since we voted for yeah, a president. Okay, okay. Today it makes it two years since yeah, we voted for a president. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I want to find out who did you vote for and if you're happy with the person you voted for, if you don't regret. <laughs> you see, this, this question you are asking me now. Yeah. Do you know why you so look at my age, I'm older than you, right? Very, very well. Okay. Ah. And I see okay, you. Well, okay? Yeah. Don't look at what the government can do for you. Okay? Don't look at what the government can do for you. Look at what you can do for yourself. You get what I mean? See, I'm talking about. Yes. Right now, if it's not what you know, I mean, what you know now, but what can you do? You understand what I'm saying? Yes. The government are on their own, and you should be on your own. You still have age on your side. Yeah. You still have age on your side. Yeah. You are still young boys. Yeah. So, you people like me could sit down and say, look, I still have hope on myself, on my own ability, on what I can do. What about you? I do, I do too. So, you going around saying well, that somebody is okay or somebody is okay. But I want okay. to find out who you voted for in 2015. Did you vote in 2015? You see, That's what I'm I voted for in 2015. Who did you vote for? That's what I want to know precisely. <laughs> I voted for APC, of course. APC, um, that is Buhari. So are you? Are you no, are I you didn't vote for Buhari. I voted for APC. APC, but APC brought Buhari to power. Okay. Yes. So um, Buhari came on the platform. Yeah, came on the platform. Okay, on the platform, right? Yeah. Of APC. Yes. So are you? Are you happy? Two years since you voted, are you comfortable, or are you? Do you regret voting for APC in 2015? You see, one thing is this: I don't regret a thing. You understand? I don't. I don't do anything that I regret in my life. Ever since I've not I've not voted, but this is the first time in my life that I voted. Oh, wow! Ask me why. Why? You see, sometimes we are all students of English. Yes. Is that right? Yeah, very right. Even there are some people that don't even go to school at all, but they are knowledgeable. True. And there are some that go to school and they don't. They are not knowledgeable. Very true. If you if if somebody tells me that, with the kind of a uh, a uh, uh, thing I'm seeing now. Is existing, I would say it's a lie. Positively. How can imagine how can you as a youth now? Anybody can empower you, do you know that? Very true. You can be empowered. Yes. Even doing even this one you are doing now. You understand, but somebody can encourage you. Yes. But we never knew then that an individual in this country could build a house for money. No, I mean you 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 you, you are, we're all saying it. Yes. So if that is what will make us know, really, that there's money in this country? But some people are sitting down on it at the expense of you, not me again. No, I'm old. Mm. So it's because of me. Because of you now, not me. I'm, 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 I'm using over time now, not me anymore. Not me. So you don't regret voting? For I don't regret APC. At all. In yes. APC. And in 2019, you still vote for APC? No, in 2019, uh, I mean, what, 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 what I'm just, I'm, uh, I mean, uh, waiting for now is to see the implementation of. What they are working on now. Do you understand? Yes. The, what, the outcome of what is going on now in Nigeria here. Yes. See, let me tell you, eh, nobody what believes is, in this country that the moment you are given a trusted position, yes. you will lie. Yes. Now, look at what is happening in this country today now. You see, in the nearest future now, you guys are going to enjoy it. Amen. Eh? You guys are going to enjoy what is going on now, mm. okay? You guys, you, you are just going to enjoy. So in 2019, who are you voting for? In 2019, a you see, PDPO. it is my right to vote. Whoever will come there, I must vote because one, I have children. I don't just keep my voter's card just for the sake of it. Oh, I must vote for somebody. 
You understand? In that 2019 that is going to come again, it's, I don't know, maybe I will leave or I will not leave. But if I happen to leave, I will still vote. Why you pissing? I mean, I don't know. Because I don't even like him from Adam. Why don't you like? How can you not like a fellow human being? I don't even like the president from Adam because he's not capable. Really? Why do you think he's not capable? He's for been there for two years yeah? now. You still think he's not capable? For, he's been two, there for years, two years, no improvements. What were you expecting? I expect he promised to do something, right? At the initial time when they are campaigning, they promised to do one or two things. And they give us time to deliver. And for two years, nothing is happening. Nothing is happening. Okay. Nothing, you know, you know. Me and you know. Nothing yeah, I is don't happening. Know. I don't know. You know now, don't say you don't know. <laughs> no, are we, are we enjoying it in this country now? Nothing is happening. But your face is fresh. Fresh, me fresh. Yes, your face is fresh. Not fresh, like my yeah. face, yes. I'm suffering, both that thing. <laughs> Not my brother, nothing is moving. Everything is standstill. Wow. The situation is critical. Everything is tight. <laughs> so if you think if you had voted in, um, who did you vote for in 2015? A Jonathan. A Bele Jonathan. If you had voted in ex-president Gulo yeah. Jonathan, do you think Nigeria would have been a better place? Yeah, at least he continued the project he has to do then for him to finish the project. He has the project doing it the first time. <laughs> You know when you when you when you vote someone in office, another cabinet will come and start afresh, okay. condemn the old project. You understand what I'm saying? That it will slow the situation of things. So definitely so, in 2019, you're asking Jonathan to come back, or what do you? Jonathan is not coming back now. The man got to the last at home. So why are you calling? Are you going to come out for me? presidency in 2019? Me? Yes. Me. I don't want to become a politician from the start. Why? No, I don't like it. <laughs> Did you vote in 2015? In 2015. Yes. You didn't vote. Why? Because you don't like um, elections or what? Eh? Mm -hmm. you, didn't, you don't like elections or why didn't you vote? Nothing. I, I just said it not to vote. Okay. So if you had voted, who would you have voted for in 2015? No. No. Please, why, why? You don't like uh, the people who wanted to become Nigeria's president? Yes, sir? You don't like those who wanted to become president? <laughs> you just did not want to vote? Yes. And why are you not talking? Talk to me now. But who do you like? You like Bari? I don't like anybody. You anybody like any can rule. Everybody is okay for me. Eh? Whom, whom, did you, whom did you vote? Yeah, I did not vote into anything. I did not vote anybody. Why now? Why you yourself did not vote? <laughs> so I never reach 18. <laughs> never reach 18. So tell me, tell me your own. Why I said I'm not reach 18? <laughs> But well, that's not true. But seriously, who did you vote in 2015? Hello. Okay, leave me a bed. Show your cat full of guns. Leave me a bed. I'm not yet to answer any question. But are you happy with what is happening in Nigeria right now? Even if you are not answering that first question. This one, are you happy? Be honest. That's why we are here for you. Hmm? Tell me. Are you happy with the things happening in Nigeria right now? What is happening? Everything that is happening in Nigeria. Right what now. is happening? As I'm asking you. I say, what is happening? Like with the way Nigeria is now, are you happy? What of you? So I'm asking you first. Are you happy? You answer me. When you answer me, I will answer you. You answer me first. At least I'm, in, I'm an elder. You have to answer me before I will answer you. Okay, yeah, okay. like my daddy now, I've asked you my question. So you first answer me then. And I'll, you now <laughs> ask me why I'm asking you, then I'll answer. But you first answer me. I don't have to answer you, you have to answer me first. Me? Yes. Me, I'm happy now. You are happy? Yes. If you are happy, I'm equally happy. And why is it that everything I do is what you are doing too? Uh, we, we are all Nigerians. Yes. Uh -huh. But you said you are happy, you are I'm happy. So, ha so if you are happy, I'm happy. If I am unhappy, I'm equally unhappy. Okay, I'm unhappy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you don't want to talk to me. <laughs> eh? Okay. I thought you wanted to to buy to buy from me. What if I buy something from you? Will you answer? Me? <laughs> if I buy something for you, will you answer? Me? <laughs> yeah. Okay, my my comment reserved though. I just say they go create work everywhere. Eh. I see no create work now. You can't go to say this one. I went to my good. You've been to say this one before. Before I go for them. 2015, you they say, don't they say this one was 2015? Uh, before I did school, I did come, I did go to school. Now. You did go to school? Yes. Which school be that one? I did go, uh, I did wait for, uh, and I did show I went to get time on state university. Yeah. Uh, now, you know.
But as in look quick, as in look up create job, now you can go to do this one. Yes, now to get some money. Yeah, so after small, now you leave this one, now go to yes. go and task again. Yes. All right. Where do my brother? At least uh, the value of the naira to the dollar was still okay, uh, very, very okay then. See what's happening now. Our currency has been messed up by the president. Is because he the he president? Has, yes, he is. He has vested interest in the currency trade now. Because the wife actually runs the brood exchange. So and they are not doing anything about the exchange rate. And it's affecting everybody. The whole economy is down because of exchange rate. Is that the only thing you're not happy there about? There are so many things. So I can't talk about it. Every, the common man on the street is not making ends meet. If not for God, a lot of people would have been dead. I call you committing suicide. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so 2019 is coming. Who do you hope to think about? Maybe you. see a good candidate who is sincere in their heart because we are tired from all this old politician. Is there a sincere Nigerian that can and become there are lots of young people there now. Like you? Yes, now We have visions for this country. For them to we, we can, can you become a president of Nigeria? Do you think it's possible? If, if they are allowed, because there are a lot of cabals that don't want this thing to happen. But if God can't be on the throne, I don't mind. I, I have good intention for this country. So if you are Nigeria's president, what are the first five things you will do? If you become Nigeria's president, what are the five first five things that you do? Number one. Number one, the exchange change. rate. We need okay. to do something Number about two. Give, bring the level playing ground for all investors to come and invest in the country. Number do three. electricity. You are selling yourself so that somebody will come and put you in a party tomorrow. Uh, Number three. Once you fix electricity, you fix 95% of our problem in this country. Okay. Number three. Number three. Yes. And, uh, those are the major things. I think. So every other thing is second. Every other thing is second. But those two things, primary things that we need to do in Nigeria. Yes, now because if you if you want a country to develop. The basic necessity for a country to develop our electricity. Yes, investors will come. They can run their plants. They can produce. We have a lot of raw materials. But if they don't have power to be able to process those things, why would, how will the country grow? Uh, yeah, Bwari is good too. You know, it's good. Even for the present condition, it's not really his fault, you understand. Okay. So it's, it's a good man. I voted for him at last. Okay, so two years after you voted for him, do you regret voting for him? or? Um, well, I, I, I did not do, but the challenge of passing to right now, I understand where it's coming from. Not really his fault. We are praying for him. I pray one day it will get better. So that is it. It's if in 2019 he comes out again to say he wants to become president, will you vote for him? Um, I might want to read more about him before I decide to vote on him or not. You want I'm to not sure. read not more sure. about him? Yeah, uh, about what he has done and what he has not done. So I'm not sure I can vote for him. Or if there's a certain change, I can decide to vote for him. There's a certain yeah. change? Yes. Okay. Good luck to that time. Okay. Do you regret not voting for Buhari? Well, I voted for my choice. Yes. Which was a uh, good luck to that time. Yeah, but do you regret not voting for Buhari? Like if you had known you that voted for Buhari? I have no regrets. It was my choice. I voted for good luck. I have no regrets not voting. Uh, okay, but we the country right now. Are you satisfied? Well, I'm not satisfied. Well, your face is fresh. And it's the glory of God. It's not the glory of God. <laughs> because you have money. It's the glory of God anyway. It's the glory of God. Okay, in 2019, if Wari comes out again, do you vote for him or if good luck comes out, you vote for good luck again? If good luck comes out, I will vote for good luck. You vote for him in 2019? Yes. Why will you vote for good luck in 2019? Uh, as a person, good luck, Jonathan, uh, in my own opinion, he has good uh, uh, I mean good intention for Nigeria. Well you know when you have bad people around your good intention may not be fulfilled. So I think that was the issue with the so You don't think Buhari has good intention for Nigeria? Well he does too. But I know different people with uh, okay, good luck has more uh, he has better I, intention for me good luck as a person has good intention for nigeria all right and then if it comes back in 2019 we'll make it happen right. thank you very much thanks for your time well guys um he says good luck jonathan if he comes back in 2019 he will vote for you 
I don't know about you. I'm not going to tell you why we vote for in 2019. But let's do it on the 2019 before we cast our votes. That's the wrap for us today on Street Gist. You heard what Nigerians have said. said. Special thanks to Emmanuel Sodi, the man behind the camera, and of course, everybody out there for joining this live feed. If you like this video, share it with your friends. Um, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Like us on Facebook. Uh, follow us on Twitter and on Instagram. And of course, tell your friends about Nigeria's come where many wonderful things are happening. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye.